Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker Dean Hop Realtors. Today I'm in the small Texas Hill Country town of Pipe Creek, not too far from Bandera, Texas. The reason I'm out here is because I got a client considering getting a home built by Diamante Custom Homes because they have a more budget friendly product called an Emerald Series. And that's what's getting built behind me here. It's an Emerald Series home being built by Diamante, 2250 square feet, and the current product, the, this is gonna be built for about 275 per square foot. So I'm excited to show you off this beautiful home. Be patient, it is under construction. All right, let's go check it out. Uh, Diamante Custom Homes has been around a long time. This is gonna be a really beautiful home once it's done. Tell nice peaks on this, love the colors. But yeah, this is a beautiful area out here. If you wanna be a little more isolated, this is a really nice town to be doing that in. Uh, like I said, just South Bandera, they got a long driveway going up and it's gonna have a three car garage, it's kind of what you're looking at right here. But we'll show off that in a little bit. But yeah, let's go on inside and check out this beautiful, well, in the process of becoming a beautiful home. Yeah, my client doesn't live here, so he's considering them as a builder. So of course I wanted to drive out and kind of showcase what this builder looks like, what this product looks like. So that's not my listing, but uh, thankfully Diamante was willing to uh, let me in the home kind of showcase what this house looks like at this cost per square foot and size. Right off the bat, you see you got beautiful beams in here. Remember this is a house that's only 2250 square feet, so it's not small, but you can tell it's gonna be luxurious. Uh, fireplace on the corner, love that. They have the, these uh, kind of accordion doors will open all the way up. We'll go out there in a few minutes. But let's go and look at what this kitchen is in the process of looking like. Nice custom cabinetry being put in. I love the colors there. They are going with a big single basin granite composite sink. And this will be the dining room slash breakfast nook right over here. Oh yeah, let's go ahead and head upstairs. I got a little extra space upstairs here. Nice little spot up here if you wanna have a poker table, projector, do a little movie thing up here you could. You got your own little toilet set back here. Plenty of space for that. And uh, the people getting this house built, they got a beautiful lot. Kind of look outside here, see what this is looking like. Really nice. <clears throat> got the trades working on uh, their driveway. All right, let's head on back downstairs. But yeah, Diamante Custom Homes has been around for a long time. And in this climate, as I'm filming it, it is toward the end of February, 2024. The market's definitely slowed down quite a bit. So when you're shopping for a custom home, make sure that custom home builder's gonna be around a little bit because I have a feeling some of these guys aren't. But this is coming in from that three car garage I was talking about. Hey, hey. So a lot of details I've put in here. We got their construction manager out here making sure everything goes right. But you're gonna have a water heater, plumb for water softener right over here. And one of the things I love about custom home builders, you can do little quirky things that fit your needs, like have a dog shower put into it. So it's really convenient to have a custom builder that can do those things. And we come in, you have your mud room, and then coming into the laundry room, decent sized laundry room. Another little detail that I like is they've got where the washer and dryer is gonna go as a mud inset, just in case there's a leak, it doesn't ruin everything else. This little spot here, that's gonna be the drain that's gonna go outside. Like I said, just in case there's a leak, you don't want that leak to kind of spread out to the rest of the house. Eight foot doors in here, you can see uh, 
There's little things like the black hinges. It's all the uh, this little closet going underneath the staircase, the Harry Potter closet. But uh, the trim work and everything is really nicely done in here. All right, you're gonna have two outlets in the ground, very convenient if you don't want wires running everywhere. And in this wing, you're gonna have the two other bedrooms and the office. Let's check out these bedrooms. Like I said, beautiful doors. You see kind of some of the vent AC vents up there. Really nice fans. Not gonna be the biggest room because remember, hey, this is a 2250 square foot home. But really nice size closets in it. Very nicely done. And this could be a Jack and Jill bathroom set up, meaning they're gonna be sharing the bathroom. So there's that. Love the little cute light fixtures. And they will also share uh, the shower tub combination, not tub. You're gonna have your toilet right here and a shower right there. And yeah, they got the shower going all, well, let's see how the tile work goes in there. But this bathroom here, not bathroom, good gosh, I'm tired. It took me a while to drive all the way out here. So yeah, I'm a little tongue tied. But about the same size bedroom as the other one. Once again, nice fan. And a really good size, what I like to call little mini walk-in closets. These definitely have some depth to it. So really nice. Coming around. We're gonna have the kind of open to the public powder room. And then the office kind of set back in the side. Uh, we got a broken window and you cannot build a home. I think it's impossible for anybody to build a home without breaking at least one window. Uh, talking to construction manager here. He's like, yep, that's gonna be fixed on Friday. I'm like, don't stress. I'm not panicking about it because it happens all the time. But I do love these beautiful doors. And even though my clients want to see this video, just to kind of check out the house. Definitely gotta go outside and check out this beautiful lot a little bit. But yeah, neat outdoor space. So you got a built-in kitchen coming. And another outdoor fireplace. And uh, any wives out there, please don't fight your husband when he says he wants to get it wired for an outdoor rated TV. Uh, what's the point of building a house like this if you can't have your little space to come outside and just watch the game, maybe smoke a cigar, maybe drink a glass of scotch, and just relax and enjoy the beautiful Texas Hill Country because it's gorgeous out here. And that's what you do. And it's nice to have that TV sitting right there to just watch that as well. All right, we got one more stop on a tour and that is to go to the master bedroom and check that out. All right, come on, good size master bedroom. We got the tray ceilings, plenty of light in here. Once again, eight foot doors throughout. Got plenty of space right there. Looks like they might be putting in a soaking tub, but nice mud inset shower. Can't wait to see what the tile would look like, but to be honest, I'm probably not coming all the way back out here, but I might. Toilet, and we're gonna have a his and her vanity. And I, I've done something similar like this in my house where we put added something like this where I got my shelves. That way you don't have to have everything out on the sink. I have a friend of mine that does custom woodworking and he built me something similar to that. And I tell you, it's really nice not having everything right on my countertop, but a good size closet. Wow, really good size closet for a house this size. And up on your cowboy boot and shoe racks right there. So like I said, I do like Diamonded Custom Homes. I've done some video tours of their $1.6 million product. This obviously is not a $1.6 million home, but it all depends on what you're looking for and what your needs are.
right, that's gonna do it for this Emerald Series home being built by Diamante Custom Homes. If you've got any questions on the house or the builder at all, feel free to reach out to me. My contact information will be on the final slide. And if you're considering moving to the Texas Hill Country area, also the search sit below area around Randolph Air Force Base, feel free to reach out to me. The best way to do that is either shoot me a text or click the link in the description box and that way you can schedule a Zoom meeting or a phone call with me. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this tour. And if you did, hit that like button. Of course, I want you to subscribe to my channel, but most importantly, share these videos with your friends and family. I'm a real estate agent. I do these videos to help my clients and to grow my business. All right, talk to you soon. Take care now. Bye.